China is getting smaller. On Tuesday, the most populous country in the world inaugurated a new 202-kilometer high-speed railway line between Shanghai and Hangzhou, connecting the two cities in 45 minutes. This latest link in the largest ever high-speed railway network has already set records, traveling at 416 kilometers an hour through the Yangtze River Delta. For passengers on the inaugural trip, the journey was a momentous one. I feel very proud that China can develop in this way. I feel very proud. China's rail network totals almost 7,500 kilometers, the longest in the world. A train attendant said the network will improve the economy of the region. I think the opening of the Shanghai Hangzhou high-speed rail shortened the distance of Yangtze Delta region. People living in the area are now getting closer. This improves the connection of economy in the area. But China doesn't intend to stop there. Plans are underway to more than double the size of the rail network to 16,000 kilometers by 2020, more railway than the rest of the world combined. Cost of the full journey on these sleek trains? 131 yuan, approximately 20 U.S. dollars, and that's in first class. The cost of the 2020 goals? a projected 2 trillion yuan, 300 billion dollars. Maryam Ishani, Reuters.